Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, Mikey Effect in the Edge browser is something that Microsoft is seemingly not wanting to bring to the stable version of the browser. And a possible reason for Mikey not being enabled in the stable of Edge is because of performance issues. And in case you're unaware what marker is, just a quick recap, it's an opaque dynamic material that incorporates theme and desktop wallpaper to paint the background um, of long-lived windows such as apps and settings. And as mentioned, marker material is not available in Edge by default yet. And it doesn't seem that it's going to be coming to the browser anytime soon. And I was asked the question, the other day, is it still possible to enable the marker effect in the stable version of Microsoft Edge, which is now currently on version 131, very soon, maybe over the next day or two, to be upgraded to 132. Now, as we can see, and the reason I've got light mode on is it works a lot better, the marker effect, you can actually see it a lot better. So, as we can see here in the title bar, there's no marker effect. Okay, it just stays that normal light gray color. And if we just quickly head into Windows 11 as an example, and we bring up a legacy component, we can see there's marker at the top in the title bar. We can see it's kind of picking up that and applying that opaque material of the desktop background into that title bar, which currently is not available in Microsoft Edge. So if you want to enable a marker in Edge, it's not a default feature. We have to enable an experimental flag once again. And if you are comfortable to fiddle with experimental features, then how we do this is we head up to our address bar. We enter edge colon forward slash forward slash flags. Just click on that. And in the search on the experimental flags page, just enter marker. There we go. And what it does it brings up the relevant flag show windows 11 visual effects in browser enables an appearance setting to use same visual effects as windows 11 on your browser we change that from default to enabled and then we'll have to restart the browser to apply that flag and now already you can see with that flag enabled we've got some marker effect in the tab strip and the title bar at the top so let's just move this around we can see that's picking up the different shades and applying that opaque dynamic material that incorporates the theme and desktop wallpaper into the browser as you can see and something else just to take note of that the flag enables if we head into our settings on the appearance page you will see it reintroduces the toggle show windows 11 visual effects in browser adds marker effect to the browser when using the default theme this functionality depends on your device and Windows settings. And as far as I'm aware, Marker does not work on Windows 10, but I stand under correction. And you can toggle it off and restart your browser directly now from that setting without having to enable and disable the flag if you so wish. And there we go. We can see that's off now. Nothing's happening. And if I toggle that back on, And we restart the browser, we can see that marker material and marker effect is back. And of course, if you want to put everything back to how it was, you can just head back, head back into your flags, change it to default, restart your browser. And we can see it'll even remove that um, setting from the appearance page. So just a quick video. I have posted quite a couple of videos on marker effect and um throughout the course of the last two years almost um, it comes and goes but it's still there the experimental flag is still there but um, just take note flags can be removed by microsoft at any given time but as of posting today the 16th of january 2025 enabling that flag still enables micro effect in the stable version of microsoft edge so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one